Hello everyone, RC Dynamics, and uh, I have my Mini T here, and I've installed a brushless motor in it. There it is. It's not the uh, the recommended one, the the Dynamite Taser, the and it has a built-in ESC. This one I had laying around from another, or I bought it for another for another kid I had, and. Uh, and I'm using this one since I already have it and it still fits as you can see the receiver I have here and a speed control here and there's the motor if you can see it yeah there we go let's take a look at it before we run it so let's go ahead and run it And it's nice to use your own receiver now. I can use my Spectrum, so it's nice. Really get it the radio it deserves. Because this is actually an excellent uh, car for this scale. It's probably one of the best. Really, it really is. Uh, the more I look at it, the more I like it. It's really nice. It's built just like a big one. It's just small. on and I've also here I'll show you this too I've also modified the uh, connector here usually oh, this is coming off <laughs> anyway uh, there's usually a uh, connector here as you can see I've taken it off here I don't know if you can see that but yeah I've, I went ahead and just used the balance connector as you can see here so I've connected it directly to the balance connector and it just it gets rid of this. This isn't much power. You can use the uh, balance connectors for power. I mean, as you can see, it's not they're not much thinner than the speed control wires. So it's not really a big deal. So that eliminates one more wiring mess, just if you ever want to do that. All right, let's get to running. Turn this thing on. There it is. Go. And of course, using a nice radio, it gives you better adjustments for the uh, steering and throttle, of course. But, uh, yeah, check this thing out. This is the first time I'm running it, so... Okay. As you can see, it has a lot more power than the stock setup. So here we go. I've also set up the speed control to bring on power slowly so that's why actually it tracks better than the stock setup because the stock setup gives you full power instantly 
with this setup it's much better it gives you a soft start which man it really makes it trackable if you watch my first video that thing's all over today with the soft start man it tracks well see how it doesn't spin out watch see it just took off without it looping watch the first video look how much it loops really helps but yeah I love it now of course it has reverse yeah, I really love it now it's really made it fun now it's a really fun car now it tracks good with the soft start highly recommend getting the speed control and the uh, new controller set up makes it much more trackable power. All right, I will see you next time.